how would you like, what legacy would you like this prize to be for this specific, uh, for, the, for, the, for the research for which this prize has been awarded? What legacy do you see in this prize? And then I hope that the uh, awarding, uh, receiving this uh, Nobel Prize, um, uh, the, uh, our society uh, will recognize uh, that uh, the importance of um, uh, medical sciences, uh, medical research. You have established a venture company which pursued practical application for reg regularity T cells. So could you please uh, tell me the long-term goals uh, once again? Please, Polish television. Yeah, microphone up. I certainly hope the actual prize um, discovery leads to therapies for people, and we're clearly working on that, and, and I feel optimistic about that. But I think the bigger issue and the bigger legacy aspect for me is that um, people recognize the value of basic research and supporting things that may take many years and a lot of time to come to fruition. Uh, hello, I'm Corina Negra from Radio Romania Science Department, and I have two questions for Professor Ramsdell. First of all, um, do you think that nowadays um, in the... But I am even more humbled and gratified by what the prize means, or what rather what the work that's being honored by the prize means, because I really do see the huge impact that it's had. Um, yeah, go, go ahead, please. Dr. Without that work, none of us would be sitting at this podium. Obviously, he wouldn't, but neither would Mary and I um, right now. So um, I'm more senior than these two people. <laughs> <laughs> it's very rewarding for us to hear that the Nobel laureates agrees with the committee. <laughs> uh,